after the the accident this brain surgery was january 21st um was cranioplasty to put a 3d printed skull back in then mm. from here to here is is 3d printed and i walked the next day i walked in the icu and i you know got out of the bed and was feeling good and then five days later um sunday i had a just a really really bad headache and it was it was hurting all behind my head and everything and um i had developed a blood clot behind the 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 new bone and so they had to rush me to surgery take it out clean it off eliminate the blood clot put it back in not what you expected no not much longer after that i would have gone home and, and thank god that I didn't go home because we would have had to be rushed back. So for people that don't that know that cranioplasty for six months, he only had half of his skull. Yeah. What his was so broken that if your skull is intact, when they remove it, they can essentially replace your same mm -hmm. skull, but his was in pieces. So he, they had to wait for his brain. That's why he had so many doctor's appointments was constantly monitoring the swelling of his yeah. brain.